Hello, this is the uh, 60 volt array I put on my uh, garage last year. Uh, it's two grid type panels, I think they're 265 each. So for about 500 watts. And I use these to run my washing machine when I put them in series with my uh, house array. So here's my control panel. Uh, the array connects up to this outlet. So uh, if I wanted to make a uh, uh, a test with you know a purely uh, 60 volt 500 watt array uh, I could do that without uh, bothering anything that's in the house this is my transfer switch uh, right now that 60 volt array is connected to the house in parallel with the house's 60 volt array so give it a little more power in the morning uh, those are purely east facing panels so they're east facing east facing panels are the best thing ever so, anyways, with both these off, this is a 60 volt panel that's totally isolated. When I want to do wash, I flip that up. And you can see the little green light on this 12 volt. Uh, that, these little, inverter, little converters are, uh, well, I bought them for China for $1.50 shipped. I mean, how do you make something like that? I mean, it even has a case. And, uh, what this does is it provides the the 12 volts to run the control electronics. That wire connects in through a switch to uh, the switch on this MSW inverter, and you choose the side which is not connected to the to the big binding post for the uh, power input, and that provides 12 volts at about 50 MA. That's all you need to run the control electronics, and then the H bridge of this. Uh, is connected to the 120 volts. Now that H bridge, you can find that pretty simply. Uh, you look inside for a big 200 volt capacitor, and uh, you connect on the plus and minus, and that ties into this switch, this outlet that is switched. So, anyways, I'm talking about this uh, manual transfer switch. It's uh, made by Tozum or Thomson. And, uh, you know, like I said, last year I, I bought a drum switch. It was, you know, on, off, on, nice single lever. Should have been no problem. But uh, the way they did the cam is that uh, this, the two switch elements would short out. And uh, I had to tear it out. And for a while I was using just Anderson power pole connectors and switching it. A lot of work. So, uh. Yeah, this, these uh, manual transfer switches are normally what you do is you tie in this to, uh, say, your refrigerator or something like that. that sometimes you'll want to run on a generator or, or house power, and you can switch between the two. And these manual transfer switches don't allow both to be on at the same time. But uh, it's a little funky. It's a, it's a nice switch. Uh, these contacts are copper, and uh, it appears to be well made. It's ISO 9000, and uh, I used to be an ISO 9000 auditor. All that guarantees is that you consistently make the same crap. The only good thing about being an auditor was you could tell management that they sucked and get away with it. But, uh, you know, you only need three wires to hook up one of these inverters and uh, you know instead of going through the 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 lossy part of converting 12 volts up to uh, you know 140 volts uh, you just go right in with the voltage but there's something a little a little strange about these it's like okay one's one's on the other's off and you do that and this doesn't connect but it doesn't do anything now if you do this one and uh, try to turn that one on it'll turn this off so yeah figure out which is most important to you to turn off automatically but uh, I kinda like to switch uh, these are only uh, this is a 2P so it's two poles and uh, you know they're about 950 or something each I got uh, 
I got two of them for 20 bucks shipped. And it only takes about two weeks. Uh, Ollie seems to be much faster on shipping. You know, they got some deal or something that uh, everything ships to some uh, U.S. shipping department. And uh, it only takes like two weeks to get them. Yeah, far better than uh, eBay. I mean, I avoided uh, Ollie for a long time, and now I just uh, do it almost exclusively. Had a lot of good luck. But anyways, that's uh, that's the switch panel. It's cleaned up a little bit now, and these uh, manual transfer switches, I think they're uh, pretty useful. So thanks for watching.